I feel as though I have something that I want to do and something I want to say with my life. Uh, but the, I think that the biggest issue comes in the fact that you have the drive and the energy and the persistence uh, to put up with oh, things that seem to go amiss, uh, things that go wrong, uh, uh, things that are time consuming and still be able to retain the energy and still be able to retain the excitement of seeing a thing through to completion. I, I think Lexington has been very good from the point of view that I need, uh, perhaps I need this kind of a situation in terms of being able to get a great deal of work ac accomplished, a great deal of work done uh, without any extraneous outside uh, influences. When I first started, uh, I was obviously concerned with much the same kinds of things that young people are with uh, learning skills and devices and so forth. And I began to realize that this is not the be all and the end all. I think the thing that you have to do is learn how to grow and learn how to become comfortable with you and the world that you're building. Well, the drawing is a diary for me. It's also an idea device for me. It's also a way of getting out a lot of thinking very quickly, uh, rather than spending a great deal of time and energy struggling with material that has infinitely more resistance. I need to work with my hands, that's for sure. I mean, it, it's, it's the idea that I've always thought that if I'm going to do something, I'm going to use my hands as much as possible and get them to do the work. Once they can't do that, then I introduce a tool, and the tool begins to become an extension of my hand. It begins to become an extension of my brain, it becomes an extension of the way I I look at things, um, and when I do a piece, and the piece suggests that there's an inner energy, an inner energy, that's important. Uh, the piece feels like it's pushing out from inside. Two years ago, I designed a proposal and presented to the uh, Donovan Trust Committee on campus, and I chose the facade of the fi old Fine Arts Building uh, to develop as a texture a texture in metal. Um, the texture has become figurative in the sense that I'm seeing this thing as, as ultimately being 30 bronze figures suspended on the surface. From a distance it'll read as one great big maze of, or a conglomerate that, that suggests the entire university's uh, community. I try to live a completely creative existence, from the time I wake up in the morning, to my choice of colors, to my relationship with my family, uh, to my relationship with people around me.